your freaking snake don't escape, yeah. we're going to staple it onto here. Uh -huh. We're going to bring it down uh -huh. and onto the top of here. Okay. And then staple it down there. Right. And then you can't get out. Yeah. So we're going to want from the top and we're going to want to come down to there. So if you go 15, it's right there, which will give us. Okay. And we're about this side. So do, yeah. Eight. Go 15. There you go. Okay, so let's do that first. So now what's 15 on? that way. I got a little. 25 minutes now. This way. No. <laughs> no, 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 no. <laughs> Where's 15? I don't know yet. I gotta find where number one is. Oh, here. <laughs> Right there. Okay, so I gotta. There. And we gotta go 25 and a half. Bra. Well, let's do this 15 first. Like, See, I'm cutting my paper, so that's why I don't want to not have it. Hey, hold, hold this there for a minute. I didn't hold it. It moved. <laughs> I'm good. Ow! Now, Got it? How are we gonna do this, though? Because we're gonna go that way. Um, so where's the marker? I think it's on the top of my toolbox. You mark the 15. Take it there. Yeah, right. <laughs> we'll take it there. <laughs> How straight can you go? I'm just following the line of the bug screen. You better be pushing hard enough to cut. I don't know. Yeah. <laughs> okay. So yeah. if we did that right. We did that right. It should fit. <laughs> so they say. Guess what? What? Neither of them. How good are we? I don't know. Lengthways we're good. Or no, that's width. Never mind. <laughs> you don't know your length from your width. <laughs> no. <laughs> uh. Choo choo. <laughs> Ow! Aren't you a little too old to be playing horsey? <laughs> I have a gun and I'm not afraid to use it. <laughs> Okay, can we do a row down here too so we can't get into the bus screen? Nope. You might have to hammer some of these in. Yeah. Because the wood is hard. Hold that table so I can move. Try to put some torque on to it. <laughs> Great, no, she's going to grab it. Attack! Destroy! 
destroy, kill, hurt. So now we gotta cut the hole and then um, done. bug screen that and no then you gotta wait because then I have to paint these braces at the back. Good, you paint, I'll go have a smoke. <laughs> and then after I paint them, we don't have to wait for them to dry because they don't touch the wall. I just need to be able to get at them. <laughs> so I just have to paint them and then we can move the table back and put even number back on and then I can finish doing my stuff. <laughs> finish painting it all. I have to paint all the Right. Well, actually, the new ones we put on. Um, actually, I have to paint all of these before we put it back. Because I, I can't get at it from the front because of the plexiglass. So you have to paint this. So I have to paint this, this and down the down end and then down the side here. Well, yeah, yeah. Up here. Without getting paint on the plexiglass. Put, do you have painter's tape? Mm, yes, I do. I'm going to put painter's tape on it so that it doesn't get on the plexiglass. Yeah, no, I do and paint. then I need silicone, so you might as well bring that up too. Uh, I don't have any. Oh, you don't have any? No. Okay, I'll get some of that tomorrow then. And then tomorrow night, I can silicone what I Look can. Out. Don't worry. Another one. Why didn't you tell me you didn't have silicone? Another one. <laughs> I don't have the silicone for this anyway. Why didn't you tell me that? I could have picked some up at Chatterson's. <laughs> Where's that stupid heat lamp you're using? Um, oh. Okay, so now, we're going to want it sitting like when you don't have the wood plate. Isn't that right close to the end? Here. Okay, just hang on. Let me measure uh, even embers tank. Their tank comes, where's your yardstick? That's my yardstick. Okay, so that's where their tank comes to. So this is going to have to go like right about here. Way to not have heat oh, yeah. burn the wood. Oh, yeah, because it's going to come out from here. I'm going to cut right around right now. Oh, well, on the here. outside of the X's. Where all the X's are. Alright. Right. Yeah, man! She's smarter than she looks. <laughs> While you're doing that, where's your camera? Camera some of these nails that you did. Hey. Ah, she's smarter than she looks. <laughs>
Boy, are you bossy. Jeez. Oh, there's going to be more yet. I know. <laughs> and now we got to cover that hole. Yeah. And that's where the saw comes in. <laughs> I'm just going to get this out of your way so that it's not all on the table when you're trying to cut. See? See, I'm being nice. Well, what did you say? screen underneath it. Well, it's not really actually, but it's going to be too big for the hole. I don't care if it's too big as long as it's not too small. <laughs> <laughs> no, the hole bigger than the, the thing. Uh, sandpaper. Over there. Just rip it. It rips. See? It rips. Wow. <laughs> it's paper. It rips. <laughs> well, that's not bad. Four after seven. Four after seven and we're almost done. Wow, wow. my You're fast. almost done. Wow, my fast. Woo. Hey, you're almost done. Oh, you gotta do a little bit of painting. I gotta do painting. And that's it. Um, we, then I have to do siliconing, can't do that tonight, oh, but I still have to do it. Tonight. Oh, you put all this back? Yeah, you can never go back on. Yeah, we're going to put them back there. And I just have to paint it before we put it, put them back because I have to be able to get to it. <laughs> okay, <coughs> now I need butt screen. <laughs> right, girl. We're changing. thing back on there. How good am I? Look at that. You missed! <laughs> My 
my aim was off. <laughs> yeah, we're gonna be dark today. Not gonna happen. It's gonna be a chicken shit. That's me. Come on, don't be a chicken shit, Panda. Come on. My body lies over the ocean. Does it now? My body. Amanda? Hmm. Do you remember that down at the church? <laughs> yes, I do. <laughs> do I remember this in my stairwell? <laughs> yes, I do. <laughs> Did I remember this in my stairwell? Yes, I do. Oh, oh, oh. There's a flat screwdriver there. I'm scared. I'll leave you the hammer. Because you'll need it. Mmm. I hate your problem. Thank you. Amanda. You'll survive. What? You'll survive. Well, you think so. Mm -hmm. That seems so bright now. <laughs> Let there be light, and there was. The back now that it's all done, dude. <laughs> you can't even tell there's anything on there. <laughs> done and done. Huh? This is all plexiglass. <laughs> the dog's checking it out. Hi, Mark. Hey, Are you in puppy jail? <laughs> So this is the finished project, or part one finished project. <laughs> so what we did was we moved this tank down this way further, so it opened up this space, and over in this space we cut a hole in the table and then put this bug screen right here on over top of the hole, so of course the snake can't get out. And this is his chi, or her chi I should say. Um, so this is uh, the heat right there, and so that way she can't get to the heat. And then underneath, okay, so all this grace, this leg, that leg, that leg, that leg, and this leg, along with these braces, 
here were all part of the original table. We added this white 2x4 here and here, and along the top here so that we could attach the plexiglass. So there's plexiglass back there, you can see it reflecting. So that's all plexiglass, all back here. Then over here on the sides, this is plexiglass up to here. Same thing on the other side, plexiglass up to here. And then the top, here and here, is all bug screen for airflow and ventilation. And then we still have to put on the floor and then this entire wall here will all be sliding doors um, when two years rolls around. <laughs> so that is the finished product for now. Um, this allows me to still roll my other cart underneath it that has the other two tanks on it. Uh, their, her baby tank and juvenile tank. And we're going to go from there. So, I hope you enjoyed that. Uh, it's not a very fancy thing. Um, I'm no carpenter and neither is my father. So we just uh, did what we could. But uh, it was fun to do. It was definitely a learn as we go type project. As you could see, there were several things that we did and then found out that uh, this is not going to work. So we had to undo it and then redo it and we made it work. So uh, just things that we were learning on the go and um, I think I'm probably planning on maybe doing like a short little blooper video. Uh, there was quite a few funny times uh, during this build that it just make good blooper reels. So I, I think I'm going to do that. So look out for that coming in the near future here. Uh, but that was my snake enclosure build. As I said at the beginning of the video, uh, it's not done. There's no floor, there's no doors. Uh, so those are going to be made later on when my little ball python is big enough to go into this full enclosure. And uh, the reason that uh, she's going to be moving through the stages of enclosures is because if you put a snake into too big of an enclosure right off the bat, they can get very stressed out uh, with the wide open spaces and stress can lead to health issues and it can lead to them uh, not eating because the snake has to feel secure and nice and safe to, to eat because essentially when they eat, they're taking away their only form of defense, which is their mouths. So they have to feel very secure to eat. And so if you put them in too big of an enclosure, it's not going to work. So uh, it's recommended and it's what I'm going to do is to just start in a small enclosure. So the little enclosure that you saw in there is a 10 gallon tank. And so that's the baby enclosure that she's going to start in when I first get her here. And then uh, she'll work up to the larger glass enclosure. And then once she outgrows that, she'll move into our homemade enclosure. So it's going to be an awesome thing to see her grow. And um, that's what we're going to do on this channel, among other things. But one of the things that you're going to be able to see is just to watch her grow. So she's going to go from a baby to a full grown ball python in two to three years. And uh, I'm going to take you along for the ride. So if you're interested in that, or if you're interested in ball pythons in general, um, subscribe, like us, and uh, come along for the journey with us. Thank you. Um, follow me on social media if you haven't already. All of my links are down in the description box below. I'll be posting pictures and stuff like that as she grows as well, as well as all my other pets. <laughs> and uh, we'll go from there. So see you in the next video. Thank you.